A grand old ruin, this. But the architecture doesn't match anything in our world. Yeah, these ruins are from a place called Tantal. Never thought I'd see them here. Well, thanks for that answer, Rex. I assumed as much. Anyway. Yo, everyone. Welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles 3, Future Redeemed. Let's see what we can do. I meant do. to do a bit of running around beforehand just to get back to where we left off last time, but then Shulk decided to start talking. So here we are. Anyway. Yeah, Tantal. Tantal's great. People generally don't like the snow areas, and I think the only issue I have with Valak is that... Is that an egg? That is an egg. Let's show them what oh, I mean... Off. Understood. I'm sure whatever's in here is no big deal. Many live Derek. Alright. I think the main issue I have with uh, Valak Mountain is simply that there's not enough... Um, what are they called? I'm having a hard time remembering. Landmarks. Yeah, there's not nearly enough landmarks in that place. I wish there was. Seriously, uh, navigating Valak, especially if you're like, looking for specific things, or if you do the unfortunate thing and you get wiped a lot, it's always going to set you back somewhere terrible. No, you did not. Hey, who's it left? Wow, that chain attack was insane. All right, that's one building. It's amazing, yay. Uh, well, I'm glad we won that. Now let's uh, focus on this. We can see Prison Island from here. That snowy mountain. It's like Capricorn Peak in the upper reaches of Etia. Yeah, it must be horribly cold there. I see it's not just Valak Mountain. Some of all rest too. Yeah. Going by the Tantalese ruins there, it must have got fused with Gembu's interior too. I would hate to get stranded in a place like that. Oh dang, it's it's uh, Tantal and Valak? That's cool. And of course it leads up into Prison Island. That's pretty rad. Right, yeah, like I was saying, like, really my one big issue with Valak Mountain is that there are not enough landmarks. My knees felt so bad. when you're trying to go back and forth and do stuff, it's just really annoying because there's nowhere close. There's almost nowhere close to where it is you want to go. I really wish they could add, like, a patch to the old Xenoblade games and put uh, unique monster rare, gravestones right? in them. Well, in one, and also make them hot points, like they are in three, because that's like, that's genius, honestly. That's a really good choice, a really great way to work around uh, not having to add more landmarks. Oh, there it is. So, you know, just do that, that'd be nice. Oh, there we go. Almost uh, got that treasure. Oh well. Oh, well, anyway, now we just need to work our way back to where we were yesterday. Which is, we were approaching the bridge. Ragwell Bridge. If you know, I've noticed that, um. Some of the, uh. What's it called? Uh. Yeah, like right there, up next to Dark Arafa, there's a weak, and it's pointing to the side. So is this thing weak if you attack it from the side? So that's interesting, if so. I know that the X-Reader updated certain things about, like, weaknesses and stuff. I just didn't imagine that to be a kind of weakness that you could exploit. Because if anything, I know that some monsters 
Like, Ignas with shields, for instance, or Turkins with the big horns. And if you attack, like, the Turkins from the front or from the back, they have a chance of deflecting. And if you attack the other guys from the front, of course, same thing there. Also, it's like... I think that's Levness wreckage. I was about to say, is that Mechon wreckage? A lot of more new enemies around these parts, and that's definitely not going to change. I mean, granted, Levness, Kevis, Levness do look a lot like Mechon. Especially like face mech on, so it's a little hard to tell. Anyway. What do you know? There's a quest icon over here. What are you guys doing here? I mean, I say this every time I find someone out in the wild. Probably just scouting and they got lost. Or something. Yo, what up? Jethro? Oh, they're already in Colony 9, okay. It's not just a, a group of random city people. Yeah, well, I mean, we're not in the same boat either. Quest just like this in the main game. Regret and resolve. Let's maintain good relations. Well, that, sound, that sounds like something we can do quickly before we head on out. Is that Ragwell Bridge? No, no, of course not. I'm like, there's no way I traveled that far. Careful, they're after us. Oh, we got some enemies to take out before we can continue with this quest. Oh, neither of these are in the Nipedia, so it's actually pretty beneficial to fight them. Also, I mean, given how much of a hard time I had with Niall, it's probably better to, like, fight more stuff and get, you know, higher level. So next time we face a tough boss like that, we hopefully won't be pushed to our limit. Done that one-handed. Oh, I passed right by one? Yes, I did. Let's keep going. This is pretty rare. I can't remember if I completed any more uh, 
collectopedias. I don't think I did. No, they're not. Ah, oh, yes, more fog beasts. Oh, yeah, and the giant Antol. Oh, gosh. Oh, I didn't even see that little guy there. And another one. Army Iraq now. Quick and painless, thankfully. Bloodstained bandana. That should do it. There's another quest icon too. Huh. Look at all this shit over here. Bold of them to get up in my face. Oh, they just come out of the ground out of nowhere, huh? Alright, well, we're taking on the biggie. Stop losing their attention. Oh, it's doing the stupid cocoon thing. It's always annoying. Now trying to summon more buddies? Too bad, you're too far from the other nest. Victory came easily. Not bad at all. Alright, let's do this. Let's give them a licky they won't soon forget. Right, a knock on metal. A knock on metal, huh? Need three more. That was pretty good. Nice beat down of a whole bunch of arachno. Got a pretty good thing to show for it too. This is pretty rare, right? Good stuff. Right, there's that guy. One of those just randomly decides to. Whoa. How do we uh, we don't. I don't want to fight it. Oh my gosh. Oh, it was just two. I thought it was more. Oh yeah, that wasn't that wasn't terrible. All right, let's return this quest now. Yeah, we did. Oh, are they here? Great.
Yep, doubt they were gonna do that. Oh well, here we go. Oh my gosh, it's always... I always like seeing all the different, like, targeting lines all over the place. We got six enemies to deal with, oh boy. Uh, make that four. Three. Alright, it was bad at first because there was, well, you know, six of them, but take them out one at a time and there's no problem. That also, Rex just kind of chews through everyone. <laughs> nice way to put it, but uh, he's not wrong. Sure you did, Matthew. Best of luck with that, Jethro. Reset to level one and uh, do a different growth route. All right, now we can focus on the task at hand and actually head for Ragwell Bridge. and scale the cliffs up to Prison Island. I think this is the right way. Yeah, well, it's the only way. It's level 40 rift, jeez. I wonder what the one summons here. Well, I mean, fog piece. Just wonder what kinds. Because the first one was just like the dogs, wolves. The one in the cave was like the flying guys and the big giraffe guys. And the one in the water, I actually didn't do that one either. It's probably like piranha haxes and stuff. Stuff that is like around that area. <clears throat> My knees felt that. So we got the bridge over there and all the little islands or whatever they're called. They used to be connected by rope bridges and they were infested with goggles or hoxes. Oh. Both of which are a pretty big pain in the ass to deal with. Goggles because they're goggles, and hawks because they have that move that could send you flying, this is pretty rare, throw you right? off into the water, and basically ruin everything. Illusory blue! Why win? Me oh, the it's me you want! Thanks for that! You are not done yet! Oh, Alright. We got another unique mech, only this time it's a cavus one. And oh my gosh, it is kicking. Uh, Shulk's up, oh, and there goes Shulk. Nebarius Invictus. Oh, 
That's quite the name you got there, dude. Oh, jeez. This is tearing through everyone, even the defenders. Hell stream. I'll probably need to do this what I did to the bird and just hit it with a very strong chain attack. I didn't expect that chain attack to do as much damage as it did, but I was like, you know what? I'll take it. Speaking of chain attack. Alright, that dealt a lot of damage. Knew that was gonna happen. You guys got the launch? Nope, unfortunately. We're go definitely gonna need to break it again. Oh, I was wondering why the sound was only in my left ear. That was weird. This also got a really strong shield power. Weakness is behind, apparently. Why is the surrounding screen so fuzzy? Does that usually happen? Yeah, we're doing pretty good. I mean, I would like if someone could break it. But you know, you can't have everything. Oh, Nicole. There goes Matthew. Right? Yep. Oh wait, A's still down. Darn it, I didn't notice. That's fine. Something shiny. There we have it. Oh. It's an ether channel. Salvage time. Oh, we did it. That was good. Took a bit of doing, but you know. The thing was actually quite tough. It had a lot of protection from the front, and it was constantly doing the ding sound, which reminds me of a a ropple. I think it's a, it's a monster of that kind in uh Cena Blade 2. It's a unique monster and more ordained that has like a 100% block rate or something like that. It's very frustrating to fight. Yay, camp! Maybe I should cook something. Alright, well, let's check and see what. Can we upgrade the X reader to the final step? How shall I go about improving? No, we can't. Same three fluid crankers. And let me check my gems. And here is my gems as of right now. So every, like the icon you see is the one that I have to make next. So yeah, I mean, 
I only have level twos of these two. Surprising. A Medus, actually, where are Medus in this one? I don't feel like I've seen them around. Shooks. Well, regardless, I was able to upgrade a few gems. Can do more later. And let's cook something. Tasty food for everyone. And then we shall save. Maybe we should wash our clothes. I don't know how dirty we all are looking, but. Time to freshen up. You gotta keep track of things. Break done. Sweet! Huh. Is this the bridge we saw from Rugwell Lake? Yes. Looks like it's seen better days. Still, seems stable enough to cross. With a gap that oh my gosh. Finally, an enemy worth my Surrogate time. Fitzpatrick. And it's a unique, like just right in the way. Alright, I mean Gosh, another unique. We've already fought like two this episode. Yeah, we can connect well, all these platforms via done. slides. That's pretty cool. Nice. And there's another one over there. Give me that. Oh, this will take us to the floor, right? This is our quick well, way back. No if we want to traverse back and forth. Oh no. Huh. Let's see where this one goes. Oh, okay, I see. Right. Yeah, there was I noticed yesterday when I stopped playing that there was a relic up here that I couldn't reach. And now I can. Check it out. Glimmer, get down from there. Good thing to hold on to. I hate those giant birds. I think I wouldn't feel comfortable fighting that thing unless I had like a five level advantage. Maybe more. They just... They have like... Like we saw from the one that we fought in the uh... Where, when we were getting the stuff for the ether lift, the Photonium. That uh, fog beast down there was one of those. And the... Uh, oh gosh, I hate them so much. They have um... Launch move, stratospheric launch. And if they grab you in the claws, they can insta smash you and it will definitely kill you. I remember the first time that I was able to take them on to fight them, like, uh, it was in Cadencia. And they were still kicking my ass. And we were like, I think he was either the same level or I was one level over them, but you fight two at once and it's impossible. Not to mention that it's not just a big guy, those little eggs in front of it are gonna hatch into who knows what. Medal. We can pocket that for later. Cool. That's uh, the next step for this guy done. How many Nopon medals are there? Ooh, another affinity scene. I want that. <laughs> Never mind. This one and the other one won't be available until we get to the Black Mountains. How do you get up there? There's a giant monkey over there that will fight. That I will fight and defeat later. Made it. <laughs> My 
Anish felt that. <laughs> Alright, now we go up this staircase. And then we can use the other ether slide. I figured we would make a ladder to go down. Nothing like but... a bit of DIY. <laughs> Oh, will this take us behind the bird? I think it will. Cool, I was not gonna fight that thing. So let's go check out the ether slide. My knees felt that. And there's the fog rift. Oh man, there's so much stuff. We'll have this up in no time. That leaves. Oh, we went from like what? Two things, one or two things constructed to six. Anyway, yeah. I should have figured that there was a. Like the wind in your hair. <laughs> I figured there would be an alternate way to get around the Vogel. I was like racking my brain of how, like, what strategy we should approach. And the only way I know what it's called is I check the eggs, and they're called Vogel eggs. So I assume that that thing is a Vogel. I don't think we've run into, like, a normal version of this thing yet. Thank goodness he ignored us. Yeah, the last enemy, the last unique monster that was flying around here was, I think, Canyon Valencia? It was a, a Rogel. And it was indeed pretty annoying to fight. What do we have here? Ah, yes. All right, let's do this. Yeah, they had it coming to them. Where are ya? Reinforcements? Now? Great! Ready and go! Great, Garland! Still need to get these guys in the enemy PDS. Yeah, so I think I need to beat only one more of them. There we go. Tops up the training, I guess. A most uncommon item. All right, gotcha. Oh, black shard. I think I still need a black crystal to make the ether lift back over where we started up here. That'll be when that is. I like this music. I just like... I don't know, I just, I like these places running around and like the music playing. I think I've said that plenty of times. I just oh, think it's nice for me to cool. do stuff that isn't just complaining since I know it probably annoys people. But I'm just being honest. I guess this is it. We're headed for the Black Mountains. That's where Prison Island is located. I don't much like the look of this weather. Oh boy, that is a, uh, that sure is something. <laughs> 